So welcome to our Project Catalina. This is a mini version of our Scandinavian ranches with some unique characteristics that I think give it a little bit more of a modern touch. We want to give you the perspective of what we were thinking during the design phases of this home, as well as some of the nuances that took place and took shape during construction. Let's get to it. On the exterior of the home, we wanted that natural wood cladding that allowed us to be able to keep with the common theme of natural finishes throughout the home. We went a little bit more modern in the overall structure of the home with a juxtaposition of a flat roof, was designed purposely for the interior and design intent of the great spaces of the home, including the kitchen, as well as the natural light that it would allow in the morning for the main livable areas of the home. On the west side of the home, it has a more form-based gable look that extends from front to back of the property, which houses all of the rooms associated within the home. One of the things that we've started to integrate more and more into our homes would be drought tolerant planting options, specifically located here in the front that allow us to be able to integrate some of the natural desert that we enjoy daily here in Phoenix. This area is ripe with functionality, which we've covered in previous videos with an exterior fireplace that will allow you to be able to entertain and be able to sit out during the wonderful evening nights that we have here and wind down for the evening with your loved ones. Now, we have some final punch list items that are being taken care of behind me in this front entranceway, but you'll be greeted with some amazing landscape lighting that will allow us to be able to accentuate these totem pole cactuses that will provide an amazing shadow detail over time as this structural cacti start to grow and take form. For all intents and purposes, we'll go through the garage. It's a standard two car garage. We'll allow you to be able to have all your mechanical needs met here in this space, including a two stage water softener filtration system, as well as our standard Navian tankless water heaters and a mechanical closet that includes an energy rated train HVAC system that will keep you cool during the summer months that we have here in Phoenix. But enough of that, let's go check the inside and see the beautiful fixtures and finishes that were designed by Urban Revival and her team. One of the themes of this home was to be able to create as much functionality in this compact design. Now this home lives similar to our 3,700 square foot Scandinavian ranches that we've illustrated in previous episodes. The main way that we were able to do that is to create a more compact design with the specific spaces, such as found in this amazingly designed mudroom space that allows for clothes and open storage, and of course, integrating any of your art pieces that fit your personal style. As we enter in to the main space of the home, you'll be greeted with a wonderfully appointed luxury kitchen that has a huge island that allows for appropriate entertaining while preparing food or enjoying any parties that you might have with your friends. It also integrates a more modern design palette as mentioned outside with our Gen Air Noir appliance package that's the first of its kind for Rebuild the Block. This really helps this home stand apart from some of the previous projects that we've recently constructed. Instead of going with a natural oak finish as found in some of our other recently constructed homes, we decided to go with a darker walnut toned cabinet package. As you can see, we went with a lot of black hardware as indicated with not only our cabinet poles, but also with this side light panel that replaced the original drywall wing wall that would have been in its place and really helps to set the tone for this home that's ripe with amazing design features and functionality throughout. As you enter into the pantry space, it's truly an extension of the kitchen, allows you to be able to hide a lot of the items that are unsightly when entertaining guests, but also provides a place to be able to reheat your food with, with this microwave that's tucked away in the space, as well as this beverage center. Some of the subtle tones that we were able to create within the space are illustrated in this quartz countertop package that integrates some minimalistic features, such as this solid slab waterfall detail that's the first of its kind for us at Rebuild the Block. It's also ripe with additional features such as a plug mold that'll be located on each side of the range as well as plenty of outlets for any of your homework or working needs while residing here in this kitchen space. Any of our homes wouldn't be complete without having specific spaces for specific functionality that are required in modern day living. Everyone knows how important it is these days to connect with family and friends and there's no better way to be able to do that over a meal in this compact dining room that has easy access to the exterior covered patio as well 
as providing multiple access points to be able to cook in our outdoor kitchen, which we'll cover later. However, this main space would not be complete without the great room feel that's illustrated here in this beautiful living room with a centerpiece feature fireplace, a subtle detail that's noted here in the fireplace surround that was a cast in place concrete detail that helps to tie the two spaces together and provide additional and ample space for as many guests as you'd like to have over or to just cozy up with loved ones. Now, one of the things that we've noted over the last couple years is making sure that there's additional spaces that will allow for modern day living to extend throughout the home. And we were able to create this as we enter in to the auxiliary bedroom wing or the guest bedroom wing that you'll be immediately appointed with a small TV room that allows for additional entertaining or for those that reside in the guest rooms, whether that be extended family, friends, or kids, it will give them a specific space, acts as a teen room, a family room, or it could even be a small office if needed. As we enter into the first of the three auxiliary bedrooms that's found here in the front of the home, it's appointed with a, not only a walk-in closet, but its own bathroom. As we go to the two additional auxiliary bedrooms, we were able to integrate a Jack and Jill bathroom, which was a critical component that allowed us to be able to get one of the most important features into this home that most homeowners will find beneficial to have in this compact footprint. This item that has become an important staple within any home will be a small home office that we were able to integrate into this home because of the amazing utilization of space. This small office space could also dual as a nursery and or a home gym if needed, but it provides a lot of options for the future homeowner to live their best life. As we enter into the primary suite, where we met with 16 foot tall vaulted ceilings that stay true to the gable form that extends from the front to the back of the west side of the home. By far my most favorite feature of this primary suite is the natural light that's provided through the three fixed paneled windows, as well as an exterior exit to the covered patio pool and barbecue areas on the exterior of the backyard landscape plan. As we enter into the primary bathroom, we wanted this specific area to stand apart from the rest and we were able to integrate a dark painted cabinetry against a Rifson oak detail with a similarly colored custom vanity top with a single trough design for the sink that allows this home to stand apart with its modern design. In addition, not quite complete, will be this large oversized mirror detail that was custom fabricated and a coordination piece between our metal fabrication company and our shower glass company. Given the more modern design, we decided to go with a push to open cabinetry hardware for both our drawers and doors. Some of the natural tones were also integrated into the shower space with this look-alike wood slatted tile detail that gives it a true spa-like feel and allows for more natural earth and wood tones to integrate into this bathroom space. Now some of you that have been following some of our previous project might note that this closet space doesn't have a stackable washer and dryer, but we've been able to utilize every square inch, provide additional storage capacity for our clients, and provide the last feature that I'd like to cover within the interior space, which would be this pass through from the primary closet into this double stacked laundry space that will allow for this usually mundane household chore to take place any day of the week by a homeowner or by the family that resides for these three main guest bedrooms, which truly epitomizes what we are trying to create with the functionality of this home. Now, any of the homes that we build here in Arizona would not be complete without a full backyard setup. So let's go take a peek at what the backyard features have to offer. So to wrap things up, let's talk about the exterior functionality of this home. We have a covered patio space that allows for outdoor dining, as well as the sun deck for lounging by the edge of the pool during the hot summer months that we enjoy throughout the year. In addition to that, we had a unique way of coupling our retention basin with this recessed fire pit that will allow for additional entertaining space and truly set this home apart in this beautiful location here in Lower Arcadia. Any house would not be complete without an area to be able to play with children or pets. In just a few quick steps, you'll be able to take a dip in this gorgeous remodeled pool 
that helps to keep with the overall modern design intent of the home with its clean neutral palette, white pebble tech, and muted gray tile that integrates perfectly with this acid wash concrete hardscape that's found throughout the exterior spaces of the home. And no house would be complete without having an outdoor barbecue space that will allow you to be able to cook and keep your house even cooler in the summer months. I can say that this is one of the most functional homes that we've designed yet here in the Arcadia market. So if you have any interest in viewing this home, feel free to DM us, reach out to us via our website or any of our social media channels. We'd love to get in touch. We appreciate you following along on our journey of this project Catalina, and we hope that you have a great day.